Uh, early on, when I was a child, I, I knew that, that I wanted to farm, that I wanted to make a living off the land, growing, growing livestock and crops. It was just something that, I mean, any farm kid uh, kind, of, kind of feels that you just, you, you're drawn to it, you have a passion for it, and it, it's, hard to, it's hard to explain, but it's just something that you feel like you're born with. Uh, and I felt like I was born with it, but and it's hard to hard to control, hard to deny. But uh, even g growing through school, coming up through school, it, farming was something that I was that I wanted to do, and I was going to put all my efforts into into being in production agriculture when when the time come. I started in high school, farming on my own a little bit, farming with my parents some, but I I tried to start building my own farming operation. When I got out of school, I, I tried a little harder and uh, worked hard. I stayed here on the farm, farming with my parents, but in the meantime, I tried to build my own operation. Um, it's something that is not easy. I mean, it, it's a life that's not meant for everybody, but it's the life that I feel like was meant for me. That's, that's a great way to live your life. I mean, and not necessarily being awarded validates that, but it's, it's, it's nice to know that an organization will recognize individuals in their state that, that are contributing to their occupation, their, their society in a positive way. And I, I think this award does a great job of highlighting those individuals that do that. We, we've had so many opportunities to grow in our leadership with Farm Bureau and, and the opportunities on our farm because of the, the connections that we have made and winning this award just helps us share our story. And it's just what I enjoy. I enjoy getting up in the morning and, and in all honesty go to do, going to do God's work. I mean, I feel like there's, there's something to be said for for raising the food and fiber for our country. And I mean, I think it's a noble profession. And I'm just glad that the man upstairs has given me the opportunity and the privilege to do that.